Drink? No, thanks. 500 pounds, trap four. Thank you. I have to say that up until about five minutes ago, I'd never heard of you, Mr. James. Call me Brendan, Mr. Ellington. I hear a lot of good things about you. I wish I had known more about you. Then we wouldn't be having this meeting now. Well, I'm a very private person. Some achievement. Look, I have had fat jokes since I was seven, Ellington. I have heard them all. So don't try and catch me out with one. How long have you owned Dennis Pollock? Every punter's dream, that was. Dennis didn't lay off most of the bets I placed with him. I won. He lost. You liked him so much, you bought the company. So now I hear Dennis has been a bit silly again. You run him. He must have known what he was doing. Exploiting the boy? A classic mug punter, more money than sense. The lad's a gambling junkie, Ellington. Dennis didn't know how to say no to him, so now I have to do that. I've offered Pollock weekly instalments. He says that's not good enough. What do you say? I want what he owes me as a lump. I can't do that. Look, my offer is a fair one. Better than you get off all those guys who do a runner, or fall over dead, or just laugh in your face. I think you'll find not many people do that, Mr. Ellington. <laughs>